Uh, you guys played really well against Air Force. What was the most impressive thing in that sweep? Uh, I think the fact that the second night we were able to maybe not match our intensity, but come to almost an equal game and just score a lot of goals. Surprising just how many goals we scored. Um, did you, did you expect that? At all? Big crowds both nights here at the Glass. What was your reaction to the crowd size both nights? That was nice. Nice to see people coming out. Uh, still on the bandwagon from last year, I guess. People still supporting us, so that's good. Uh, you guys have two weeks, a uh, week off now before you go play Northern Michigan. Is that a good thing or a bad thing to be off? Uh, I think it's a good thing just because it's this early. Uh, more time to prepare for the next team we're playing and just to get guys into the system, the younger guys, uh, a little bit more. What are the kind of things you guys are going to be working on over the next week? Uh, just the same system, just try to, like the coaches will obviously try to pound it into the guys' heads a little bit, so we just guys know where to be, you know what to do, and uh, work on the power play, kind of like a little bit more, I guess. You guys moved up in the national rankings this week after that sweep. What's your reaction to something like that? Uh, it's nice. I think it's the first time we've been ranked in the top 20 since I've been here, so it's pretty cool to be uh, recognized on a big scale. Uh, Dan got two wins this weekend in net for you and looked pretty well. What's your reaction to how Dan played this weekend? Uh, the guys knew he was going to be good. Uh, Bax, is, uh, Bax got a lot better throughout last year. Obviously, only got chances in exhibition games, but I think guys knew he was ready. He was going to be good. You got two wins last week. I bet you couldn't ask for a better start to your uh, to your sophomore season. Absolutely not. It was a good time. The guys made it easy for me, and it was just exciting to get in there for the first two. Um, what was it like Friday night compared to Saturday night for you on a personal level? Friday night was definitely more nerve-wracking. It was a tough time getting in and a tough time getting that first shot in. But after that, it just balled out and it got easier. Defense, I thought, played very well last weekend. What was your opinion of how the defense played? I thought the defense played unreal. They uh, blocked a lot of shots. I mean, scoring opportunities that they had were just shots from the outside. It it easy for me. Uh, you guys are now off for a week. I imagine that's probably a little bit of a good thing and a bad thing. How do you react to something like that? Uh, you got to keep it the same. You got to work hard both times and just keep keep it rolling. What are some of the things you guys are going to be working on over the week off? Conditioning, still keep it up, and uh, again, power play stuff and making sure our systems are down. I mean, you, you were here last year. I mean, there was a couple. There was a big crowds out here on Friday and Saturday night. Were you surprised with the crowds, or what was your reaction to how packed it was around here? I wasn't. I uh, wasn't too surprised. I mean, we had, we had a big crowd last year. The whole world and It was nice to see we had another big crowd again. How, how did you end up coming to Bemidji State? Uh, I was fortunate enough to come over. Tom. Uh, Tom saw me in a game. Uh, one of my last couple of games, and then he. I was fortunate enough to catch his eye. And they gave me a great chance to come over here and just playing for uh, Calgary Jun Junior A Royals back home. And Where are you originally from? Calgary, Alberta. You know, some people have, uh, around town have liked how your helmet looks. So why don't you tell me about your helmet and uh, why, why you chose what you put on there? Sure. I just got two two goalies on the side here. Just uh, just any goalie I thought of the old school look is, uh, is in right now. Got Got my nickname on the chin there, and I got uh, a couple of BSU logos, and a couple of my my Canadian boys over here, Bob and Doug McKenzie. Uh, you guys have a week off this week. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? Uh, I think it's a little bit of both. I guess. Good. We haven't been on the ice too much for our first game, so now we get two more weeks of practice before we play again. But uh, I don't know. The spots we can probably play pretty well, so then we have to take a week off now before we play. Again. Air Force, a uh, pretty good series for you guys. What was the best part about that series for you guys? Um, I think the best part was, uh, well, sweet just because last year they were one game away from the Frozen Four and we uh, made it to the Frozen Four, so we knew we were both pretty good teams coming into this year and, and we had pretty well the first weekend. So. Uh, how much confidence do you guys have in yourselves right now? What are you going to be working on?